James Webb Space Telescope just brought us this brilliant view of a colorful cosmic gas known as L1527, which looks just like a cosmic hourglass. The orange and blue regions of dust and gas have been blasted out by a new forming star right at the center. The blue areas represent the thinnest dust, while the orange parts are where the dust is thickest. The thicker the layer of dust, the less blue light escapes. This dark line obscuring the star, which is around the size of our solar system, is what's called a protoplanetary disk of gas and dust, which feeds material to the protostar. That spinning disk will eventually coalesce into planets, moons, and rocks that will orbit the star in the future. Below and above this disk, you can see the star's light glowing just like a lamp. The protostar is just 100,000 years old, which is pretty young by cosmic standards. The star is classified as a Class Zero protostar because it's at its earliest stage of formation and is not yet able to generate its own energy through the nuclear fusion of hydrogen. The star hasn't fully formed yet, thus it's still a small, roughly spherical hot clump of gas somewhere between 20 and 40 percent the mass of our Sun. As the material from the protoplanetary disk falls into the star, it gives it more mass and compresses it further, heating up its core. Through this feeding process, the star will eventually start fusing hydrogen and creating its own energy. The reason why there's only one star forming at the center and no other stars around it is because of the shocks and turbulences that stop star formation. So, the star is using the material all for itself. L1527 is part of the Taurus Molecular Cloud, a star-forming region home to hundreds of infant stars about 430 light-years from us. Our own Sun and planets have formed in similar conditions, so this can help us learn more about the Sun's formation over 4.5 billion years ago and how we all came to be. Webb captured this image through its near-infrared camera, NearCam. The telescope, orbiting the Sun about one million miles from Earth, is determined to find the first galaxies formed in the early universe and to hunt for baby stars forming planetary systems. If you like this video, please consider subscribing and click the notification bell so you do not miss any upcoming videos.